Hey ladies and gents, I got a replay for you guys. Uh, this is actually coming from two of my clanmates. Uh, I got Catechus in the BF-109 and I got Master Chief in a Spitfire. Uh, these guys are kind of playing the, the uh, preferred high-low mix. Uh, usually an ener energy fighter, heavy fighter, uh, up high, and then a uh, pretty good turn and burner down low uh, in Master Chief Spitfire. Um, CAD's flying up here almost at 2,000 meters. BF-109 is one of those great vertical planes. Uh, it does well in the climb. It does well in the zoom and boom. It does well in the speed uh, where Master Chief is playing uh, the Spitfire, of course, which is notorious for being uh, really kind of good at just about everything. Uh, the turn and burn, um, even some of the altitude performance, and it's also got some really nice guns on it. So he pulls around here on the first bow fighter, and he's got his first kill of the game. Turns back around, picks up the bow fighter coming through. Oh, there we go. 220s and 213s on this uh, on this plane really, really wrecked. However, he seems to be getting a little bit slow in his old age because it looks like Master Chief's already turned the first objective. Um, not like there's a competition or anything with these guys. <laughs> uh, back we go over. Uh, Cad's got one more boomerang to nail. Finishes him off. Nice, 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 nicely done. So they're already up two objectives. Um, and you know, and that's really kind of the key for a lot of these battles is how fast you can turn these objectives uh, and, and turning them as quick as possible like they just did there. Uh, the garrison, of course, has already been picked over. Uh, at the first part of the game, you see them split. Uh, usually, uh, we try to split up as much as we can, one going to one garrison, one going to the other garrison to try to get the, the objectives turned as quick as possible. So, um, we got Cad. He's looking around here, picks up his first bomber of the day, the DO-17Z. Uh, yeah, he doesn't have much chance against the BF-109. Um, picks up the DO-17, and here we go. Uh, yeah, 220s, 213s. Uh, there's not a lot. Of, there's not enough HP in the world uh, <laughs> for Cad in the BF-109. I'm not saying he has, you know, some. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm not saying. Well, I'm saying he probably has a BF, a stuffed BF-109 BF he sleeps with. I'm not saying that, but I'm pretty sure he does. So, <laughs> he just loves this fucking plane, and he plays it so well. That's the great thing about it is. So, back to altitude. Picks up a, another kill. He's on the BF, he's on the bullfighter, and down he goes. Um, he's going to follow Norris all the way to the deck, and he's just going to keep on pummeling him. Can't let them uh, heavy fighters get away too often. Uh, they have a tendency to really wreck your day. Uh, they will continue to make passes on you until they eventually kill you. Uh, so yeah, uh, finishes off the bullfighter, and now he's looking for his next target. Uh, we got the I-16 coming through here, and oh, doggy, boom, he is dead. Puts him up to almost 6K. Uh, Master Chief's finished off the uh, P-40 on the other side of the map, and these guys are just racking uh, this team. Uh, back and forth, back and forth, finishing off plane after plane. He uh, picks up the BF-09B up tall up high, not tall. I don't know why that, where that come from. Um, finds the BF-109B flying through here, and CAD's all over him. And you guys, and this is kind of, see, if you watch CAD uh, and, and Master Chief right here, to get these nice combat scores is that they always got this gun going, right? Uh, they're always looking for the next target. So around they go, and, and they're always looking for things, like I said, closest to them. They're not flying around a lot. Uh, they're picking up close targets and putting down a crap ton of shells. Picks up his, I don't know how many kills he got on that one. Uh, but he got his Akuma Sutsi, Akuma Sutsa medal, uh, something like that. It's one of them shiny, blingy things. It's already up to almost 9,000. There he goes, past 9,000 personal combat points. And he's almost got the bow fighter. Slowly but surely, he's going to pick him up here. Finishes him off, gets the Guardian, puts him up at almost 10K. And Master Chief finishes off the BF-109. These guys play f are flying so well together. Uh, whatever uh, CAD's not killing, Master's killing. And they, of course, are playing, like I said, they're wingmen. So they're working together. So they're going to move over here to the next objective uh, and see what they can do. He's got that thing not quite in the vertical, but she's still climbing. Putting up 21, 2,200 meters already. And, you know, and that's what the great thing about um, BF-109s, heavy fighters, and energy fighters in general. Uh, they do a nice job of taking objectives like this. So, pulls down. 
finds the BF, uh, finds the bullfighter, slowly, surely working him over, pulls around, and, oh, Master Chief, I think, got that bullfighter on that deal. And uh, now they're going to start working down a little bit lower. They've knocked out the higher altitude aircraft, uh, and now they're going to start working on the, uh, the lower altitude stuff here. Picks up the BF-109 coming through, puts her down hard, Master's up on top. Yeah, I don't think he's got much chance. Like I said, with them two working together, uh, they're eventually gonna <laughs> they're gonna eventually gonna get you. So they pull back around and CAD. So like I said earlier about uh, target awareness, um, you know, uh, putting up high combat scores. He could have stayed on that boomerang right there, but it would have took him a while to get turned around to stay on his tail. So he just happened to pick up the target of opportunity with the boomerang, uh, and exactly what he did right there. They flipped the objective, and now he's got a ton of aircraft coming through here. Picks up the KI-43-2. Oh, Raptor duel for the fellas. Nice job. Picks up the BF-110 running away, and that's about the time he knows an I-16 on his tail. Yeah, that's not good. Um, that plane can actually do a fair amount of damage. So he puts her in a dive, gets picked up speed, and I'm sure in about this time, like I said, he's probably calling for uh, Master Chief, and Master Chief, like any good wingman, uh, comes over to deal with an aircraft that's got a better maneuverability than CAD's BF-409. Picks him up enough. Uh, yeah, so the Y-16 got into a turn fight with uh, with uh, Master Chief, and that lets CAD come back around to finish him off. And Master Chief's going for the last of the BF-109. So, winged legend for CAD, and I do believe, yeah, uh, Master's sitting about 8,000 combat points. So, between the two of them, they've totally dominated this match. Uh, they've got a 3-2 to two advantage on him. And there's still a fair amount of things to shoot down. So, uh, back to uh, altitude, slowly but surely. Uh, and he's got Master Chief right on his tail. Uh, heading back to the center objective. And if they can, like I said, they hold on to, if they just keep this 3-2 uh, straight up here, right here, they, they're going to win uh, relatively easy. <sighs> So back to center they go. Um, well, let's see what we can find here. I'm not terribly sure. I guess I didn't even remember what they all had left to kill. Uh, but the squall line is up. They both look like they're both sitting pretty good. I think they both dropped down and probably repaired uh, before they come back here. So pick up the KI-43. Oh, yes, the 20s, the 20s. And he's going to go back into the vertical and see if he can pick off this other BF-109B BF uh, who is up there working over a... Uh, defense fighter puts him up to 15,000 on the combat score and he's got the BF-409B down below uh, Master Chief puts a freaking nice pass on him uh, and CAD's gonna come back down here uh, they're gonna see what they can finish him off and oh kill secured but I, I do believe Master Chief had most of that damage <laughs> so back to altitude and they're gonna see what they can do with the P-40 here uh, yeah, this game is pretty well done and over with. Yeah, it was a really good game, though. I, I really enjoyed it. Uh, these two have uh, pretty much dominated every place they've been. Picks up the I-16 going through. Slowly but surely, boom, finishes them off. Puts them up to 17,000, tip of the spear. They got the Raptor duo. Uh, they've pretty much owned it. So 10K for Master Chief and 18 for CAD. Hell of a game, fellas. Uh, thanks for sending me the replay.